Hey guys, it has been all morning since I have checked in. Um, I have been super productive all day long. I went live with some new tank tops um, and I really have just been powering through my day because I actually have a lot of fun things to do today. Um, I am going to the drive-in with my dad, maybe my mom, um, and then I'm also going to play pub trivia with my friends Nick, Jackie, Megan, and Jared. Um, my Jared is currently at work. Number 10 in the Netflix reality show rounds. Status and strategy collide in this social experiment and show where online players flirt, befriend, and catfish their way towards $100,000. Uh, with 110 points, Mount Cleverest. With 114 points, the Rescue Rangers. And this week, with 116 points, the Uneducated Guessers, yay! With 121 points, show me the Merlot. And their second time winning a Cannon Guild virtual pub quiz we have with 127 points, Law and Aurora. Okay, so my dad and I are at a makeshift drive-in. Say hi. Hi. Um, we're going to see, what is this movie? Call of the Wild. Call of the Wild. And this is a fundraiser for what? For the local nurses in the area. Yep. So we're in a mall parking lot with a blow-up screen. We'll see how this goes. So, Call of the Wild was a good movie. I recommend it. However, I've officially decided I can't watch dog movies at all. This one wasn't even really sad. It were, there were just parts where, like, bad stuff was happening to dogs, and I was like, no. Can't do it. So, no dog movies for me. No dog movies for Kiwi. I mean... Unless they're a sidekick and nothing happens to them. Because I love dogs, and I love cute dogs. But when bad things happen to dogs, I can't do it. And, like, if there's a scene and they're, like, something bad happens and there's humans, I'm always like, what happens to the dog? Well, it's usually any cute sidekick creature. Like, I was really concerned about Hey Hey and Moana a lot. I was. You were there. That dumb chicken was too dumb to know he was in danger. I wanted to make sure he was okay. Anyway. So, that took up a lot of my night. Because I had to, like, it was 30 minutes away from my parents, which is 30 ways, minutes away from here. So I definitely was out after curfew tonight. There's no curfew. Oh, yeah, huh? Yeah, there is. Their sign over by Winter Garden says CO curfew, 11 p.m. to 6 a.m. Weird. I thought it was dumb. I thought week. so, too, considering stuff's open. But, um. Maybe Polk County's done. That's where I work. Oh. There's not be done with. Yeah, well, the sign was, like, right by Winter Garden Village. Weird. Like, right by those neighborhoods, like, past yeah. it. And then I was like, I'm guilty. There's so many people out, though. I'm guilty. It's like, technically, I would have been home before 11 if I would have stayed at my parents. But anyway. <sighs> so, tomorrow's Monday. See you then. Bye-bye. Thanks for coming to the show! Ask for a look! I've been saying! Ask for a